guys, my name is Nat. Welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a BoxyCharm unboxing video. Um, this is the box for the month of March and I haven't looked at it yet so I'm pretty excited to see what's inside. Um, I currently don't have any makeup on my face just because I want to try on the products as they come and I'm really excited. So this month's theme is Creepy Cute and it looks like we have one, two, three, four, five items in the box this month. So the first thing I see is the Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. This um, is a travel size and it is retailed at $16. That's very expensive. So I'm just going to be applying this onto, um, ooh, it's kind of watery, uh, like a liquidy primer I guess. So this primer is supposed to instantly blur fine lines and pores, leaving skin with a velvety smooth even finish. Um, it left my skin definitely soft, but I'm not sure how I feel about it yet. I have to put on my foundation and see. So I just finished putting my foundation and my concealer on my face and then a little bit of powder just to set everything and I really like the primer. My skin looks super flawless and super pretty so I'm really happy about that. So the next thing I see in the box is this. Um, I think I saw this on the BoxyCharm Instagram page. It's like a half fan brush, half contour brush. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It is really chunky. Um, it's chunkier on one side than the other, I believe. Um, it's really pretty and it's super soft. It is from Crown Brushes. Yeah, it's from Crown Brush and it is the Deluxe Fan Brush and it is retailed at $18.99. So yeah, it is a little chunkier in the middle and then towards the sides it gets um, thinner. So I'm just going to be testing this out with my MAC Soft and Gentle. This stuff always works for me so <laughs> it's what I'm going to be using. It is giving me a really, really beautiful highlight. I just don't like that since it's so chunky I can't really be super precise. But apart from that, I actually love this so much. Oh my god, I really like this. So I give that product a 10 out of 10. I really, really love the glow that it gave my face. Wow. So the next product I'm going to pick is this one. This is the Real Her Expert Advice Lip Liner in the shade I Am Precious. This lip liner retails for $12.50. So if you see that, the color that I got is like a really pretty mauve type pinky color. It's just a really wearable pink. I'm really, really happy with this color. I want to put it on my lips, but I'm pretty sure there is a lipstick. Ooh, too far. I'm pretty sure there's a lipstick also in the box because I just saw it. <laughs> so this lipstick is also by Real Her and it is in the shade I Will Succeed. This looks like a taupey mauve kind of like terracotta color. I just mentioned three different colors, but <laughs> I'm gonna go with terracotta actually. This is a matte liquid lipstick and it's retailed at $15. Okay, so first of all, look at this packaging. It says the name of the color on the packaging. It's super beautiful. It's like color block, so this side is white and the other side is black. And then this is clear so you can see the color through it. I really like this packaging. So on the little sticker that was on the box, it looked like a terracotta color, but now that I see it up close, it is definitely a peachy color. So this is definitely not a color that I would pick for myself. It is very, very peachy and it is pretty light and I'm not sure if I like it. It's something that I definitely have to get used to. I feel like it brightens up my face. Um, but I also feel like my actual skin color, like my lip color, is peeking through the lipstick a little bit just because it is darker than the lip that I'm wearing. Um, but I also think this lipstick would look really pretty if it was topped off with some gloss, so I'm probably going to end up doing that. It is really pretty. It hasn't dried 100% matte yet. It's actually like pretty tacky right now, which I don't like. Um, I'm just going to wait and see <laughs> if it dries completely matte. Um, but since it is tacky, I can't like put my lips together because it will like make them stick up. I don't know if that makes any sense, but it'll leave like little weird dots on my lips. 
So the last thing in the box is the Urban Rustic Palette by Naked Cosmetics. And this is retailed for $39.99, which that is a lot of money. That's really expensive. When you open it up, it has these three beautiful shades. We have a olivey green one, an orangey one, and then a nice purpley one. So that is it for the box this month, guys. The box this month was over $118. That is crazy. You only pay $21 a month for the box, and it comes with a bunch of goodies and a bunch of cool stuff in the box. So I loved all of the items this month. Definitely my favorites were the two lip colors and the palette. They are so, so beautiful. Everything was so beautiful. And then these are just so aesthetically pleasing. I don't know, but they're just really cool. Oh, also the lipstick dried completely matte. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. If you're interested in any of my social media, that will be linked down below as well. Bye.